we've set the bar high for ourselves. A lot of this is kind of stuff that we're trying to pull off. They're typically the things that people do in big feature films. It's no mistake that Steven Spielberg's name is on it. I'm detecting interference from a solar flare. It all starts with my character, Molly Woods, um, coming home from a year-long solo mission in space. When she's been away from her family for a year, there's some adjustment issues. Mom, I'm fine. I'll be right there, okay? So the first episode's about reconnecting and then finding out that she didn't come home alone. I honestly, I don't understand this. Understand what? You're pregnant. That's not possible. She had an encounter with something, this entity that has been able to present itself. You need help? Help? What does that say about an alien race that can do that to us? That it's preying on our deepest emotions? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. So much of our story is about people trying to connect to each other and the kind of this question of what is human seen through different angles. Oh, wow. Her husband, John, in an attempt to give the thing that Molly wanted most in the world, the child, he decided to create one. Let me introduce you to my son, Ethan. The problem is that Molly's not so sure that Ethan quite does it for her, that it's quite childlike enough. It was like this when I found it. Basically, he's creating a new species here, because this is this artificial intelligence that's the first time in history is actually learning the same way that humans learn. But it's different now with her. Your mom has to get used to being back home again. She was up there a long time. To bridge that divide between human and machine, we have to give the machine the human experience. You want to raise it with free will. The show takes place 30 years from now, but it doesn't feel as if it's so far, it seems strange. You have computer screens on refrigerators and you have flat-bottomed eggs. We're using all these cool prototype cars in the show. Those little elements are fun and add a richness to our story. Still no answers. As well. You know when you look at those posters of the galaxy and it says you are here and you feel so insignificant? That's how we feel when we start to find out what's really going on. There's a mystery, and it's interesting to watch how it's going to unfold for each character. Welcome back, Mr. Yasumoto. You think we found them? I think they are already here. If that's true, we're way out of our depth. Don't trust them. Who? Oh. Anybody. People are going to tune in one for Halle Berry. She is a hero of the age. We have a great array of people that are coming on board to help us tell this story. You don't have to do this by yourself. You're here now with us. Week to week. I hope that we give them a roller coaster ride. It's okay.